King Aegle Wolf. King of Wessex and Mercia. Breathwalder and my beloved father. Is dead. And is now at peace with his maker. They will offer you the throne. Are you sure? <laughs> yes. Then in all humility, I will accept. No. You will refuse the crown. Grandfather. If our Lord should ever see fit to choose me as king, even over this wasteland, then I swear to you, as if you were sitting next to me now, that I will fight and struggle to restore your kingdom to its former glories. Whatever the circumstances of his birth, Egbert saw in Alfred the future ruler of the country he was creating. The Pope blessed him and crowned him because he... We all know the circumstances of Alfred's birth. Follow my child. It was my belief then, and it is still my belief, that Alfred has been chosen by God for great things. One day, you may be king. I hope so with all my heart. I know it's burdened. They're very real. It's like forever dragging a stone up a hill only to watch it perpetually roll back down. Your brother should never have been made king. The decision has placed our whole realm in jeopardy. He is a weak and feeble leader. In a time of war, we have enough warriors committed to our cause to shut the doors and kill them all. Which began to be some of the Holy Synod. Not before, to discuss your attacks in the church. You must take this seriously, Alfred. They are not the only voices raised against you. You will be queen to a kingdom at war and likely soon to be attacked again. You will be married to a king who is in present danger of being overthrown assassinated. There are those who... The king has many enemies and few friends. Want to overcome him. That is why he must do all he can to consolidate his rule before he can be truly threatened. Guards, arrest the traitors. You will soon have to answer the questions, Lord Alfred. That I promise you. The ships of a large Viking army have been seen in West Wales. As a man of God, do not advocate peace and mercy. Yes. Of course. My prince. Which is bestowed on you with the blessing of God, that by the power of the Holy Spirit you may resist and cast out all of your enemies and all the enemies of the Holy Church of God. The conspiracy against you. Those who wish to overthrow and kill you. We thought it is their leader. Confronted by evil, we do not surrender to it. Or fear it. We have the one thing that the pagans do not have. We have the risen Christ on our side, and with God on our side, how is it even conceivable that we could lose this final battle? Our king must be prepared to do the most terrible the things. things against all conscience. Who no, let the king? If he wants to save us. If you're afraid, you're already dead. There is a season. A time for every purpose under the sun. A time to love, a time to hate, a time of war, and a time of peace. This is the time of war. This is the time to hate. We shall fight. It is the only way. Wessex will never return to the Dark Ages. We shall never surrender, whatever the cost. Our Lord Jesus Christ is with us, and I will not leave his side. You think me weak? and pliable and cowardly. But alas for you, you are totally wrong. There is good and evil in everything and in everyone. We are all, all of us, devils and angels. The greatest Christian virtue, Alfred, is humility.